Dearly beloved, how are you? Are you well? We are all well only, but there are many struggles. In the place where we live, work, run our business, our ministry, unrelated people are speaking badly and fighting us. They are doing various things against us. What to do? Are you thinking like this? Are you worried? Don't be discouraged. This is the world. They will hate and accuse us without reason and moreover, random people will work against us. We ourselves will not understand why these kinds of people are increasing in the world. Are you worried and saying how do we live then? A man of God named David is telling his experience in Psalm chapter 124 and verse 6. Let me read it for you. Blessed be the Lord who has not given us as prey to their teeth. Their teeth looks like they will bite and destroy us. Have you seen dogs? Sometimes they will show their teeth like that. Have you seen the teeth of lions and tigers? Even when we see their teeth, we get frightened. They will simply bite and destroy lives. Is this kind of people present around you? People who bite and destroy us, they will be present within the house, in the office, place of ministry and even in the church. They will look like they will bite and destroy us. The Lord God did not give you up to their teeth. He protects us. If you ask who are they, in the first verse he says, when men rose up against us, people rise up, against us and they look like they will bite and destroy us. Aren't they working like that? David is writing about his experience. In his life such wicked people rose up against him to bite and destroy David completely. It is written in the scriptures that the Lord didn't give him up into any of their hands. Even in my ministry journey so many people spoke, wrote, held meetings and spoke against me like they would bite and destroy me. They said, Mohan see Lazarus is finished, that's all. They tried to disturb me in every way they could. They did everything, but I am joyful, happy and safe. Do you know why he didn't turn me over to their hands? He didn't give me over to their teeth. Without the Lord allowing it, no one can touch you. Without the Lord allowing it or giving you up, no one can overcome you. Do not worry, don't be afraid. They will come close like they will bite and destroy you, but they cannot touch you because the Lord God is with you. So don't be discouraged looking at these circumstances, people who can bite and destroy, people who talk badly and work against you. Say, dear Lord, you are protecting me from their teeth. You haven't given me over to be bitten and destroyed by them. Praise be to you. Just keep praising the Lord God daily. No one can touch you. The dog will bark from a distance. It cannot bite you. Wolves will rise up like they will bite and destroy you. They will surround you. It cannot touch you because the Lord is on your side. So don't be afraid. Don't be discouraged. Just be brave. All you have to do is tell the Lord that, Lord, you are there for me. You will not give me over to the hands of anyone. Praise you for protecting me. Keep saying this. They will run and be scattered. That's all. Just like that, say, Lord, praise be to the God who is protecting me from being given as prey to the teeth of my enemies. No one can damage, hurt or destroy me. You are with me and guiding me continuously. Praise be to you. In the name of Lord Jesus. Amen. Amen.